welcome back to our channel it's Bella here in today's tutorial I'm super excited to bring to you guys this bronze glam eye makeup using the morphe 35v palette so if you want to see how I achieved this look then just keep on watching and if you want to be entered in our giveaway this month make sure that you give this video a thumbs up make sure that you are subscribed to our channel and that you have your post notifications turned on and then make sure you comment done down below so the first thing that I'm going to be doing is grabbing my Huda Beauty Overachiever Concealer and I really like to use this concealer as an eyeshadow primer because I feel like it really doesn't budge. So I just applied it all over my eyelid and then I blended it out with a damp beauty sponge and then I set it in place with the Huda Beauty Easy Bake uh, Loose Setting Powder. So like I said, I used the Morphe 35V Stunning Vibes Palette. So the first shade that I went into is the shade Knockout and it's this really beautiful frosty white shade and I used that as a brow bone highlight so I just put it where my brow bone is and I just highlighted that area going in back and forth motions just to really get a nice vibrant payoff. And then next I took the shade Heat which is this really beautiful terracotta orange shade. And I just put that in my crease going in back and forth motions once again. But I did use a defined angled brush and I created a line above where my actual crease is. And I will go ahead and blend that out next using the shade Turned On. And I just went in back and forth motions and I really wanted the crease to be really warm because the lid was going to be super neutral. So yeah, I just went in back and forth motions just to really smoke out those shades. And then next I took the shade Little Black Book, which is this matte black eyeshadow. And I took the same defined angled brush and I just drew a line directly over where I applied the shade Heat. And I really like to layer my eyeshadows like this because it's kind of foolproof. You just go back in, blend it out, and then add depth, and then go back in and blend it out once again. So I, as you guys can see, I went back into the shade Turned On once again, and I just blended out that black line, and it, it blended out really seamlessly. I was really impressed. And then I went back into my Huda Beauty Overachiever Concealer, and I just cleaned up all over the lid. This step is definitely optional, you guys. Like... For those of you that comment down below for us to do looks without a cut crease, you definitely don't have to do this step. You could just go straight in with the eyeshadow. And I did set the, the lid after I applied that concealer and then I went in with the little black book and the shade turned on together. And I just started to add definition to the outer corner, fading it inwards just to really add dimension to the look and just to add a little bit of darkness on the outer lid. And then for the lid, I decided to go into the shade Private Party, which is this gorgeous bronze shade. It's super, super pigmented, and I just feel like this is such a gorgeous yeah. eyeshadow just for whenever you go out and you just want to look nice and glam. And then next, I took my NYX Glitter Primer and the glitter from Violet Voss in the shade Taylor. And this step is definitely optional. You guys do not have to do this step because a lot of you guys kind of get mad at us whenever we add a glitter to a dedicated eyeshadow palette tutorial. But I feel like the glitter really elevated the look and I really love expressing my creativity and artistry when I create these looks. So that's why I added the glitter. And then I went into the shade Knockout once again just to highlight my inner tear duct. And then for lashes, I used my Sophie Bella Lashes in the style Barbados. They're super dramatic glam lashes, so definitely check those lashes out if you guys are really into dramatic going out lashes. And then next, I took the shade Turned On once again, and I just started to add depth in the lower lash line area. And then I went back into the color Little Black Book, and I also mixed it with the shade Addicted in the palette. It's like a very dark brown matte shade. And I just went in back and forth motions, really starting to deepen up the lower lashes. And then this is where you see me applying that shade Little Black Book to my lower lashes, focusing it on the outer corner. And then I blended everything out once more with the shade Turned On. And this is pretty much the finished look. All I did was I added some lower lash mascara. And this is the finished look, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn your post notifications on so you never miss a video. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.